Hi, I'm Minister Ralph Friedrichs. Making a difference is my belief. Here is my challenge to everyone. I just want to challenge everyone, a challenge I'm also trying to live out. No matter how busy you are, there is always something you can do to brighten someone's day. Give someone a hug. Send a text with an inspiring quote. Friends, mail a heartfelt card. Tell someone how much you appreciate him or her. If we look each day presents us with opportunities to share kindness throughout the world, my core belief that we are called to not only love God and love people, but to carry out the great commission and share the eternal message of Jesus Christ. My goal is to help you reimagine your life and let go of the thoughts and behaviors that undermine you so that a renewed and fulfilled you can emerge starting today. We must love one another as God loves each and every one of us. To be able to love, we, my friends, need a clean heart. Prayer is what gives us a clean heart. The fruit of prayer is deepening of faith, and the fruit of faith is love. I hope each and every one of you remember to show compassion and have a, a great life ahead of you with Jesus Christ. Good afternoon. My name is Ralph Friedrichs. I am an author and addiction recovery coach, a life coach, and minister, and the host of this show, the Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version of this if you go to YouTube on their channel, Take Your Life Back Today show. You can watch, uh, listen to us on uh, iHeartRadio, iTunes, Google Music, Amazon Music, and other digital platforms. Friends, today is Sunday. It is the day of Sabbath. The hand of God will make a way where uh, there is no way. The hand of God will bring water out of a rock in a dry place. The hand of God is over your life, and he has a plan for you. Maybe God didn't meet your uh, expectations uh, because uh, he wants to exceed your expectations. Think about that. People can say a lot of things about you. People can do a lot of things to you. And even if you've uh, believed them up until now, the word of God still stands over your life. What God put in is so much greater than what is taken out. Some of the stuff you're going through right now as you're watching and listening to me has taken you to a place uh, you ask God to take you. You just don't like how you're getting there. But listen, just because you view, you're you used to being disappointed, don't give up on God. He won't let you down ever. Trust me. I believe God is calling us into a season of greater faith than uh, needing to, to see the reason. I believe God is calling us to deeper faith than giving up the first time uh, uh, doesn't, if, if it doesn't work. I believe God is calling to someone watching and listening to me right now that you cannot give up on yourself because he has not given up on you and he will never, ever, ever, ever give up on you. I believe that you know that God is the answer to straighten your life up and make your life even better. Call me at 844 help You and I, we can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves. Always be good to each other. Remember, a simple smile to anyone it can change your life and it can make a difference in someone else's life. Always remember this, that God is the one and only answer to your life. May God bless you and have a great life with Jesus Christ in your life. Take good care and we'll talk to you later.